Okay, welcome back guys. So I'm just gonna just show you the the ending of the sorrel mixing. So as you can see the sorrel, so this is the following day around um say so 7 pm right now and I'm just going to pour the sorrel. I just got something bigger because it um wait is enough just to get something big to for the space, right? Okay. So I'm just gonna use this jug just to get the the sorrel. So at this moment you need a strainer. Normally some people use like a um you know those cloth that strain it really 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 good so that you don't have no little bumps or nothing like that. So just straining it basically in this thing. Alright? And Okay guys, so um, I strained the sorrel into the, the pan and then I put it back into this one so I can sweeten it, right? So I just used the strain as you could see that I just, um, just strained it. So now I'm going to put some sugar. Now you can put any kind of sugar you want, granulated sugar, brown sugar. I'm using some dark brown sugar here. So I am using um, just... Uh, I can't see what is this amount on the bank, but as you can see, the size of one kilogram worth of sugar. Now, it all depends on your sugar level, however, you would like it. But I know I made this before, so I know that this amount of sugar is okay for this amount of cereal. And if you even want to just stop a little, just to um, stir it first, taste it just to see it. The so you just sweet for your taste, okay? All right, so yeah, okay, guys. So I ended up using all the sugar. That's so, how, as I said, I knew that that bag would be okay for this amount. But if you're using less um water, but it's already no definitely less sugar, right? So now, normally now people will use like lime juice or this is. The, Pretty much the sorrel has a very strong sour um, taste already, so I don't think lime juice is needed, but it's up to you. You taste it and you just do it according to your taste buds, right? So now we're going to um, bottle up the sorrel. This sorrel, uh, this bottle. This bottle of sorrel was $12.50. $12.50. And I was like, are you kidding me? No. The sorrel, the two bags of them, about two dollar piece, that are four dollar. Bag of sugar, I say one, three dollar, right? Four plus three, seven quick max, right? No, me, I don't fill up about nearly six of a buckle. And me by the, at least this is not me by the buckle, yeah, for twelve dollar fifty. This could even give me four cup of sorrel, right? No, but so you go. Alright, so I'm going to buckle up the sorrel. Just to show you, the amount of sorrel. <laughs> when me buy the tell that. Just going to show you guys. Show you. Show you how much to do. Just, just, just take a look. No. Almost, not even half of this. Right? I that me buy for twelve dollar fifty. But three really is the only thing. And then I want to do all this work, which is not even hard. Laziness. See what laziness has. Anywho, so go get some pimento. Some pimento seed to put in the sorrel. Now the pimento it fermented. You know you can take about six eight. It's up to you. But eat alright. I don't want to eat it on my hands, so two, four, seven. I just drop it in, so. Right? Alright. So, that's what we buy for $12.50. Really? Alright. Okay, guys, this is the sorrel. So, it, guys, so, it, um, I got seven bottles. Two, four, six, seven bottles. Um, and here, yeah, pimento pan bear things. Oh, one thing I forgot to tell you guys you can 
put um alcohol in your soil rum or whatever alcohol most likely rum and i place a little of this um my mom brought it back when she went to iceland just a 40 percent you know so strong like the rum yes yeah, so yeah but if you don't want any alcohol in it you, you, you don't have to drink with alcohol like i've tasted sor sorrels before where we can't even drink half a cup we can't even drink quarter cup the way it full up a beer rum because me not a, a rum it like that still but if you don't love you know, rum and an alcohol then go for it yeah so seven bottles guys seven bottles well thank you for watching easy sorry making juice nothing too hard but one thing if you don't have white counter tops just keep it in the sink <laughs> keep it in the sink because this soil can be a bit messy when especially when you put it in the buckle so just keep it in the, the sink and just do your thing and